Logitech G recently launched its Aurora collection of gender-inclusive gaming peripherals, which are designed for gamers who care less about performance and competition and more about comfort and style. The collection includes a wireless headset, wireless and wire keyboards, and a wireless mouse, the G705. The Logitech G705 is a small, counter dual wireless gaming mouse with six programmable buttons and pretty, Aurora collection-inspired RGB lighting. It's a solid, reliable performer thanks to clicky, tactile switches and Logitech is low-latency light-speed wireless connectivity. The G705 is a good gaming mouse. It may even be one of the best gaming mice, especially for users with smaller hands. But for users with larger hands, the G705 may not do enough to warrant its somewhat pricey $100 tag. Design and Comfort The Logitech G705 comes in the Aurora Collection's base colorway of whiteness and has an all-white body with lavender accent buttons and a lavender scroll wheel. The mouse has a diffused RGB light strip around the back curve, which is tuned out of the box with the Aurora Collection signature lighting, a pastel pink-blue combo which is, admittedly, very pretty. The mouse has no customizable parts, so the only custom accessory that goes with the mouse is the Aurora Collection mouse pad, a large, 18x15.75 inch cloth mouse pad that comes in the Aurora Collection signature colors of white nest, green flash, or pink dawn. The G705 is a small, ergonomically counter wireless mouse with six programmable buttons, left slash right click, scroll wheel, DPI switch, and two thumb buttons. The bottom of the mouse features a power switch as well as an input button for switching between 2.4 GHz wireless and Bluetooth connections. The mouse's buttons are all relatively easy to reach and have tactile, clicky switches. The scroll wheel is notched and is just a tiny bit stiffer than I prefer, but overall it's pretty comfortable to use. Performance The Logitech G705 looks more like a portable productivity mouse than a gaming mouse, but it is a gaming mouse under the hood. The G705 sports Logitech is light sync sensor and has a sensitivity of 108,200 dpi and a 1000 hc wireless polling rate. The G705 performed well in a variety of games I tested it in just about everything, from CS, Go to Rise of the Tomb Raider to Overwatch to Subnautica, Bull Zero. The mouse moves smoothly and quickly over most surfaces thanks to its gliding feet. Its buttons were tactile, responsive, and easy to click, and I experienced no issues with lag or latency over the Lightspeed 2.4 GHz wireless connection. With only six programmable buttons, the G705 isn't the best mouse for MMO or MOBAs though it does have a second layer of programmability via Logitech's G-Shift feature. Features and Software The G705 works fine out of the box, it's preloaded with the Aurora Collection signature lighting and comes with three preset DPI speeds that you can scroll through with the DPI switch. You'll need to download Logitech's GHUB software for further customization programming buttons, changing the RGB lighting, and adjusting or adding DPI speeds. The G705 has four sections in GHUB, device settings, sensitivity, assignments, and light sync. In device settings, you'll find a general overview of the mouse's properties, including current firmware, remaining battery life, and the onboard memory mode toggle. In sensitivity, you can adjust the mouse's DPI presets and polling rate. In assignments, you can assign everything from commands to macros to audio samples and voice effects to the G705 six programmable buttons. Lightsync lets you set custom colors and animations for the mouse's three RGB zones. Battery life. The Logitech G705 gets approximately 40 hours of battery life, which is enough to get you through about a week's worth of moderate to heavy gaming maybe. However, most of its competitors remember, this is a $100 premium mouse can make it to at least the 60-hour mark, if not much further. If you turn the G705's lighting off, its battery life jumps to a much more acceptable 145 hours, but are you really buying the G705 to turn its lighting off? The Aurora Line's lighting is one of its biggest strengths. If you're not here for the aesthetics, there are plenty of comparable gaming mice to choose from. Plus, there are mice that can look pretty and chug along. Teeth Rock at Cone XB Air has 5 RGB lighting zones and still hits 100 hours on a single charge. We hope you found our in-depth review helpful and informative. Comment below if you have any questions about this review or explanation. Thanks for watching.